Ada's Market Replay is a multifunctional tool that recreates realistic conditions for trading education using data from the past. Such functionality is also known as the Trading Simulator. It includes a playback and a trading panel and is primarily aimed at beginners. We've created this video to show them how to launch this important tool in the professional Addis platform. Want to know how many clicks it takes to start Market Replay? Let's count from the moment the Addis platform is opened and ready to go. Do you think it'll be more than 10 or less? First, click on the plus sign. Click number 2. Open the chart. You can also open the chart through the chart button in the main menu, but clicking on the plus sign fits better into the screen recording program. Click number 3. Choose the instrument. Let's use the Euro Futures. Click number 4. OK, the chart is open. Click on the replay button, that's 5 clicks. Activate the mode, that's 6. Select the chart for replay, that's 7. Click play, that's 8. And there you go, the market simulator is running, and it only took 8 clicks. Now, you can drag the market replay panel to the left, and open the chart trader on the right for trading. Let's try placing an order. The order is placed. The trader simulator is now operating and you can enhance your day trading skills without risking your capital. Download the Addis platform to do it on your computer. Let's now explore some of the more advanced features offered by the Addis platform. These tools will help you make more informed trading decisions. To start, let's enable level 2 data loading. This will allow us to activate an indicator that analyzes significant levels in the DOM. Secondly, let's set narrower time frames to skip low volatility overnight trading and start the playback from 10 a.m. Click play. Wait a bit. Add the DOM levels indicator, the playback will automatically pause. And let's also increase the playback speed to 20x acceleration. In this mode, it only takes 3 seconds for a 1 minute candle to appear. The bright levels highlighted on the chart by the DOM levels indicator reveal the market participant's interest. Analyzing how the price interacts with these levels can provide a lot of valuable information. Pay attention to the 1.05740 level. Here, a seller declares their interest by placing a large order. Or perhaps there are several major sellers. Let's suppose that large sell orders will reverse the price. Let's check it by placing our sell limit a bit lower. Well, it got triggered right away because the playback speed is quite fast. Let's place a take profit around the morning flat area. Of course, it would be better to prioritize setting a stop loss first, but since we're in the simulator, we're not risking anything, we're just exploring the platform's capabilities. The price is moving in our favor, having turned away from a significant level identified by the DOM levels indicator, or you can also call it a market heat map. Now let's try another training method, this time using a footprint chart. The footprint, also known as a cluster chart, provides information from within the candles. Other traders don't see it, so we can use this information to our advantage. Since we don't need market depth and the time frame is 15 minutes, let's select the simplest data type. It's enough for demonstration purposes. Let's hit play. The data loads very quickly. We can observe and study how the past scenario unfolds as if in real time. It took a few candles to create a support line, but sellers managed to break through it. Buyers tried to push the price up from the round level, but they didn't succeed. It's no wonder that on the following candle, this level acted as resistance. At 11 o'clock candle, the price is increasing, despite the seller activity noted on the 1045 candle. It appears that sellers can't maintain their momentum. This suggests that sentiment may FT in favor of buyers. It seems that the 1115 candle reflects a moment of market indecision and balance, which, of course, is temporary. However, at 1130, there was a bullish impulse. Look at this large cluster. It suggests bullish efforts to break through the balanced zone. Sellers attempted to resist, but their efforts were unsuccessful. Let's assume that these stuck sellers will become a support level. We'll set a buy limit in case the price drops here. The price breaks the previous high, trading activity increases. Look at the brightest cluster. Here, buyers were active, but the price moved down. Buyers lost at this level but it can provide resistance, so let's set a sell limit here. One of the orders must be triggered. 
The first order to trigger was the buy order. Of course, we should consider a stop loss. However, in replay mode, we can afford this negligence, which would be unacceptable in real conditions. We can learn what happens when trading without stops, but not this time. The price reached the resistance level, which acted as a take profit. Now, let's try training with market profiles. This is a cluster chart in volume histogram mode. An indicator of daily profiles has been added to the chart. At the beginning of the European session, the price is trading within a zone of significant volume that formed the previous day. It has already tried to decline but returned to the volume zone. The price may attempt to rise next, so let's see where it might encounter resistance. It might happen at this protrusion on yesterday's profile. Let's place a sell limit just below, anticipating a reversal. A bit higher, there's another potential resistance from the protrusion on a day before yesterday's profile. Let's place a stop loss beyond this level. Our take profit target will be the maximum volume level around 4,315. The take profit worked, the stop loss held firm, let's remove it. We've gained the necessary experience. We hope you found the market replay simulator interesting, as it's a tool you should definitely use for self-training and trading on futures, cryptocurrency, and stock markets. Before you start your training, here's a useful tip. Click this button on the settings panel and set up hotkeys for replay to adjust speed, play and pause, as well as for making trading operations. Thank you for watching, download Adas. See you in the next videos.